Hello all you bodies and welcome to the Minecraft Weekly News with myself David and himself Toby and as we went over the news for the last seven days we noticed that Lydia went to England and ate some cottage pie, Jacob left us all hanging inquisitively and Dinnerbone had a name day. Early last week, Mojang announced a contest started by 57 Digital, who are the creators of the Mojang endorsed app Papercraft. The idea is to create a diorama, which is a sort of 3D scene, in order to win some epic prizes. Simply check out the contest rules, download the Papercraft app and select what blocks and tiles you wish to use in order to create your papery Minecraft set. This is the last call for the contest as it wraps up August the 30th, so build, take that picture and get it submitted. Links are below. In XBLA news this week, Major Nelson of Xbox Live fame stated that for the week beginning 15th of July, Minecraft was top of the arcade titles for full purchases and second place for unique users just behind Blobs 2. Given the looming presence of Title Update 12, which 4J are constantly bug fixing, Minecraft can only continue to grow on the Xbox platform. Absolutely, and to add to this, 4J Studios mentioned the existence of mashup packs on their Twitter account, and when quizzed by all and sundry, they explained that a mashup pack makes Minecraft look like another game. So, texture pack, skin pack, user interface, music, and themed world. Now, I don't know about you, but these sound excitingly like the recently added resource packs on Minecraft for PC. Perhaps we can think of mashup packs like a little themed package with added extras. Speaking of packs, Skin Pack 5 is being released fairly soon, with 9 skins being teased ever so slightly in this image posted by PlayXBLA. Does anyone recognise any of these characters? Bottom left has a distinctly Assassin's Creed flavour. As August approaches, so does the UK Insomnia Gaming Festival. This usually huge festival has been made an even bigger deal this year for us Minecrafters with the first ever Insomnia Minecraft Expo UK. Running from the 23rd of August, the Expo will boast panels, signings, events, tournaments and costume competitions. With tons of notable names in attendance, from Bebop Vox to members of the Ogscast, this looks to be a huge debut year for the Expo. Toby will be heading there to represent MC Spotlights and the Minecraft forums and he'll be on the panels doing signings too, so if you're going, keep your eyes peeled for him and give him a big cheery hello! There's still a few tickets left so run like a frightened crocodile over to the links below to get yours before they've gone. For your slice of adventure map this week we have The Lost Potato, made by the illustrious iCrafting. Frankly this map is blowing up big style with thousands of downloads and dozens of let's play in its first 20 days alone. Beginning with the prison break, you'll set out on the adventure of a lifetime in search of that last potato on earth. Filled with surprises, brilliant environments, intelligently laid out puzzles, command block dialogues and 1.6 features such as four-legged friends and leads, the first chapter of this series is a corker and we can't wait for more. As always, the map is linked down in the description below. That is all for this week, we'd like to take this moment to thank you guys for all your lovely comments each week, you keep us smiling and we hope you're smiling too. Up here on the left you can collect to view last week's news, and up here on the right is Toby's I'm going to insomnia announcement video. Don't forget you can hit the subscribe button to stay with us through the week and beyond. We'll catch you guys soon if you don't catch us sooner. Take care. Woohoo!